Suzanne? Did you spend the whole night on the couch? Yeah. I couldn't sleep. Um, you go ahead to work without me first. I'll shower and come in. Why don't you uh, take some time off? Hmm? Chris didn't come home the whole night. Maybe you should give him a call? Check if he's okay? Why should I call him? Tarts and oranges. Buy already? No, ma'am. Flowers? No, ma'am. You eat some ingredients? No, ma'am. No, ma'am, no, ma'am, no, ma'am. Can you still stand out there and smile at me? Ayah, we got so many things to do. Hey, go, go, go. Where's my handbag? Better keep quiet. Unless you want to get out Chinese New Year duty. Every Chinese New Year, your mother always go crazy. Not safe. Let's discuss business. Okay, so I need about another week or so to finish off the app. But in the meantime, I've created a WordPress website for Taobao Fitness. Mm. Tell me what you think. Good work. Full looks appetizing. <laughs> Ayah, Sana, Sana, remember to clean the balcony and the plants. Trim away all the dead leaves. Otherwise, how to have good luck flow? You are, Jing Kai. Huh? What you don't need, what you don't want, throw, okay? Chinese New Year is around the corner, four days more to go. Huh? Go and buy new clothes, okay? I have so many things to do. Hurry up, hurry up! Ben? Ben? Yeah, what's up? Oh, I'm so sorry, but do you think you can help me take care of Grace? I have something I need to do. Sure, take as much time as you want. Okay, thanks. Hi, Ma. Please, I... But I have nowhere to go. And I have Grace with me. We'll be homeless. Ma, can you please... I hope you reconsider. Thank you. Goodbye. Ben, what's going on? Okay. Let's do it. Mm. Ayah, Sana, Chim Kaya, can you please make yourself useful? Help to clean up there. And what thing and I cannot reach. Adam, good you are back. Adam, we are very busy, you know. Where have you been? I went to drop Mel off at school. Oh, oh um, she seemed down this morning. She said she misses there. Yeah, have you heard from Shelly? Yeah, the kids and I just video chatted with her on Sunday. And how is she? Mm, well, it's there's cold, but she's doing fine. She's super busy, but. She's happy. Hope she'll be back soon. Mm. Adam, how are things between you and Shelling? Okay or not? Yeah, okay. Um, I'm going to the gym, so I'm going to get my stuff. Azul, sure. can you man the counter? Sure. Yeah. Everything okay? Yeah, I'm going upstairs to check on Chris. Try and get him out of bed. Otherwise, you'll do nothing but mope all day. Yep. Gotta go. Thanks. Okay. Grace and I have to leave the flat. What happened? My friend's boyfriend moved in with us. And he can't stand Grace's crying or the mess from the childproofing of the flat. I tried to offer her some money for the inconvenience, but she refused to take it. So for the time being, hey. while I still have some money, I can afford to rent a new place for Grace and I. And so that phone call, you were asking your mother for help? Yep. But you know my dad probably won't let her bring us back. Ben, you need help. I can. Ben, it's okay. Don't worry. Grace and I won't be homeless. I'll find a way. Right, Gracie? Are you hungry? It's time to feed you. Oh. Yes, come to mommy. Huh? I'll get you something to drink. Okay. Are you hungry? Hmm? Hello, Eric. Yeah, uh, can we meet Miss Urgent?
Chris, wake up. Son, wake up. Son. Wow. I just fell asleep. This is not the time for sleeping. I'm one off today. I don't have to go to work. I'm more worried about you and Suzanne. What are you going to do about it? She's... Why should I do anything? She doesn't tell me anything. She's having a baby. being emotional. Pregnant women are like that. But the way you two were fighting, she did not say she would get an abortion, but I don't want her to do anything rash. So why don't you go and find her and reassure her that everything is going to be okay, that she has our support, okay? You saw them, right? The look on all of their faces. They all think I want to get rid of the baby. I'm sure they don't think that. They're just shocked that you weren't happy about the baby. Yeah, but that's how I feel. Uh, I'm so tired. Go inside. Try and get some rest. Gina, where's Suzanne? Hi, Vivian. I don't think Suzanne's after talking to you right now. She never is, but I want to talk to her. Vivian. I'm her mom. I know what's best for her. If you want Suzanne to treat and respect you as her mother, maybe you should start acting like one. And really think about what she wants and needs. First time I held Grace, I just can't describe it. I know then that I just needed to protect her. And no matter who the father is, she's my baby. I feel the same way you do. I don't even need to hold my baby in my arms to feel it. But what I don't understand is, why doesn't Suzanne feel it too? Suzanne, I came back to check how you're doing. Uh, well, I got some sleep, so I'm not so tired anymore. Suzanne, I'm sorry. For what? I should have been nicer to you in Okinawa. I, I didn't know you were pregnant. Why didn't you tell me? Well, I'm still trying to process everything. I've only been married a few months, and I don't even know if my marriage is going to last till Chinese New Year. Suzanne, you've got a baby now. It's not just about you and Chris anymore. You can't afford to just think about yourselves. Give yourself 24 hours to mope, and then get your act together. Charge bravely forward, and work things out. You know, I'm surprised that Suzanne would lie to you. She didn't lie. I mean, she did tell me in the end. But what I'm angry about is she has such little confidence in me. 
that she thinks that I'm not capable of being a father. She shouldn't be making decisions for you. It's your baby too. Who gave her the right to control and manipulate everything? To control and manipulate you? Of course, she's not. Okay, she's not Vanessa. Suzanne... She's just not good with things on plan. She just needs time to adjust and accept things. Chris, just one piece of advice. <coughs> Fight for what you want and don't back down. Hi, Yeah, I'm here. Joy. What's up? You're studying in January. Seriously, don't be such a geek. Amir. You forgot that we have a math test coming right after Chinese New Year. I hate it when you're right. You know, I think we should start Geek Club. We can be the founding members. Ah! Uh -huh. <gasps> you're not funny. Hey, Ben. Oh, hey. Uh, Grace is napping upstairs. Oh, great. Thanks. So, how's the job interview? Not going so well. But I'm sure something will come up. Yeah. Uh, have you had lunch yet? No. I'll get you something. Thanks. <sighs> oh, hey, Gina. Hey. Um, Ben's in the kitchen. That's okay. I'll just wait here then. How are you? Uh, I'm not so great, actually. Not only am I job hunting, I'm also house hunting. What happened? I just need to find a place to stay. Oh, do you have any places? I mean, I can't really afford much, but... Mm, maybe I can call in a few favours. I think I have a friend who might have an empty room you can stay in. It's okay. I mean, I want to pay my own way. I can't afford much, but... I really want to be independent. I understand. Mm, I'll try and find a place nearby with cheap rent so that men can babysit for you while you work. That will be great. Thanks, Gina. You're welcome. Actually, I think I might have a few houses here that you can look at already. Mm, how about this one? Oh, yeah. Actually, I was looking for something like this. It's just a room, but perfect for grace of me. That's nice. Mm. Okay. All right, what's going on? I'm just finding the resemblance between two of you. Of course not, Amir. Ben is my step-uncle. Step-uncle? Not half-uncle. Okay, let me explain. Auntie Leanne had my mom, then she married her husband, whose kids are Adam, Ben, Christopher and Diana, from his first marriage. Then she had Eddie, so Eddie is my mom's half-brother and also my half-uncle. But then Ben is my step-uncle, so there's no way that we can look alike. Got it? Huh? <sighs> Clear as mud. Never Hello, mind. Joy. Hi, this is P. Dakong. Uh, this is Amir. Hi, Amir. Hello, Amir. Hi. Hello. Uh, can you please explain to Amir that we are all family? Maybe you'll have better luck than I do. Uh, okay. Uh, Lian is your grandma, who married my son many years after she and your grandpa had your ma. Who's Joy's grandfather? Uh, Doctor. Uh, it's very, very complicated. Okay, uh, and I don't think your grandma and your ma will want everybody to know everything. Uh, okay, I think it's easier to explain your mess. Homework. Come, let me help you. Yeah, come. Hmm. Are you sure you want to help them with that? That's all level mathematics, you know. <laughs> and mess was my best subject, okay, in school. Okay, okay. watch this. Okay, show us what all you right. got, Tagong. Yeah, yeah. No.
Why are you so worried about having a child? Chris, we're barely making ends meet. Aren't you worried? Of course I'm worried. Who isn't? Ben has lots of doubts, but look at him now. No, no one is really ready until they actually have to step up. Do you think you are ready to step up, Chris? Of course. I'll start my job search and I'll find a good job that pays a lot. Chris, you're always like this. You, you, well, you just expect the good job is going to fall on your lap like that. You know, if Adam wasn't your brother, I seriously doubt that you even have a job. Suzanne, I promise you, I can do it! Don't make any more promises that you cannot keep! We have a baby on the way! So you think all I do is make empty promises? I didn't. You don't even believe in me at all. No, Chris, I... Do you... I'm completely useless. No, I didn't mean it that way. Please, I... Please don't... Chris, oh my god. You know, Vanessa's really having a tough time. Looking after baby, looking for a job, and now a place to live. What? You okay? You seem distracted. I'm okay. I'm just uh, thinking about stuff. Everything okay at home? Chris, has he and Suzanne sorted stuff out? The one who needs sorting things out is Suzanne, not Chris. Why are you being so tough on her? She should know better than to lie to him. Chris is the father of a child. Yes, and she is the mother. It came as a surprise to her. Surely she's entitled to some time to work things out and get used to the idea. You yourself took so long to accept Grace, remember? You're right. I'm, I'm sorry. The one you should be saying sorry to is Suzanne and not me. I'm gonna go home and check on her. I'll call you later, okay? Okay. Bye. Bye. Papia. They're trying to study. Please try not to distract them. <laughs> oh, so, so sorry, sorry. Uh, just carry on. Uh, I'll just sit here and stone. Hang on, I have an idea. Amir Joy, if you're free tomorrow, why don't you come here after you finish your assignments and Uncle Apia will teach you a few songs on the guitar. Really? Awesome! But first, study. Uh, hi, Latika. Hi, Chris. I just came from the hospital. Oh, I was just about to go and visit him. How's he? Very tired. Sleeping. Oh, then I better don't disturb him. Uh, how's his recovery? He lost strength in his muscles. He can't really walk, but he keeps trying. That's great. I was afraid he'll get discouraged and give up. Well, Arjun's a positive person. No matter how difficult things get, there's always a choice. Uh, I mean, keep. Oh, true. Keep. Keep, keep. Keep, keep. I keep them. What sort of spring cleaning is this? Everything also keep. Your dead plants, throw. Huh? Why you want to throw those? They are already dead. Still alive, okay? Dead already, dead already. Huh? Okay, keep, keep, keep. Yeah, happens every year. Yep, it's a Lim family Chinese New Year tradition. This is my second favorite part of Chinese New Year. Hmm? Then what's your first favorite part? Yu Sheng, everyone tossing salad together and all those auspicious things. You just like to see salad flying everywhere. Anyway, let's throw all this while your ama is distracted. Come, come, come. Ayah, what the? Keep all those kids. Keep all kids, keep, keep. Still alive, still alive. Already. What the? No man is worth all these tears, babe. I agree. <laughs> Men are all idiots, especially your husband. What? I agree. <laughs> 
We'll leave you two alone to talk, okay? <laughs> Hiding somewhere, I presume. Hey, I was thinking for the sambal eggplant, should I grill it instead of frying it? It doesn't matter as long as there's sambal on it. Shailing will lap it up. <laughs> well, that's my first time cooking reunion dinner. I think it's gonna be fun. I hope I think so. <laughs> oh, Shailing. Mm. Hayawati, I told you I want to use the expensive chopstick for tomorrow night. Hayya, where is it? Hi. 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 Hi.